Um, I was going out to the ball um, with my man and your man. I was kind of out in front and I took the pass the my man and whatever way the cornerback was coming out hitting the ball. He kind of hit it over. It was We thought he was going to hit it to, in front of us, but he ended up hitting it over our head. So I ended up turning, stopping, and uh, your man went to turn, to, obviously, to go back and get the, the ball. It was gone behind me, like, and your man just drove me out over in front of me. And he does a big snap. So I ended up. I couldn't get up on the, off the ground then after that, like, you know. Um, it was a month after that then. I got, had to do kind of a bit of um, pre-rehab <coughs> before, like, for the operation to build up their muscle and all f around it, like, but, so then it was a month after that then. I got the operation, it was 23rd of August when I got the operation. Um, so it was a month then. It was about a month, I'd say, after that. The, was, when the pain was, was very sore and I was getting a high temperature at night time and all, and like, so I knew something wasn't right. Like, though. I was tired, I only had the flu for a week, like, but I was drinking, taking hot whiskies and trying to get rid of it, and but sure, I wasn't going, so I ended up having to go back to the hospital. And sure, they operated on me the following day, I went in like, straight away, and I got four more operations then. Since that one, so it was five operations I got all together on it. Like. I'm walking around now, yeah, it's a bit stiff and a bit sore, it's very weak, like, it's, you know, I mean, all the muscle is kind of, a lot of muscle is, is waste, like, it's gone, you know, when you're not using it, it's, you're, you're losing it, like, as such, but, um, it's, it's not too bad, I'm able to walk on it, like, and it's getting better, it's getting stronger, like, I can't really, really plow on too hard with the rehab either, so it's just, I have to kind of take small steps now, until, I have nine more weeks of, of antibiotics left, so, after the nine weeks, um, Please God, that'll be the end of it now, and I can drive on away. Like, I'm not allowed work either, and I'm not allowed to do any hard rehab in case like the infection can kind of, you know, I mean, their body's vulnerable now. Like, so I have to, I have to mind it so the the infection couldn't flame again if I got doing too much on the knee again. Like, so yeah, it's frustrating now because I'm feeling alright. Like, but the I just want to put it behind me and kick on with the rehab and work and everything. Like, you know, and I come on 15 tablets a day. Like every six hours, I have to take them. So. I'm, the body is I'm tired all the time as well, like I wouldn't be in the best of order like either, but I'm happy to be out of hospital anyway, and I'm, I'm improving every day, so please God now, it'll be a distant memory in a couple of them after the nine weeks, you know. Well, I, was, I not kind of want to set too much targets, as in like a date, because I don't want to be, yeah. like I, you know what I mean, it's frustrating enough when you're with this much of a kickback, like, but all I want to be doing is to be bar part of the set up again, say probably around April, May, even, April, May, to be even just doing a bit of training with the boys, and even if I have to do a little bit of individual on my own, like, um, it'd be powerful, like, if I could even get back in doing that, you know, and then I suppose she would take it from there, then, like, even get back hurling, like, it'd be... It'd be part of the setup, even, and then sure, I take small steps, and sure, you wouldn't, you know, wouldn't know how it could, could kick on then, like, and you, you might get back playing, and sure, I'd see then from there, like, and I'm going to set an actual date, like. We were actually looking at the interview with Dowler Lazo, and I was saying that the, I was saying, Jez, why should have took the Mickey out a bit more, like, but, so I ended up, and yeah. And I ended up saying, she was only a f out of the Eagles up in the outer Tanya. And so the next minute, Lars says, Right, sure, we'll interview you. So I said, Right, sure. and that's how it, it was a bit slagging at the start, but that's how it came about, like, you know. It was only meant to be, like, we weren't, it was only meant to be an old, it wasn't meant to go up on anything, like, it was only meant to be a bit of old crack, like, but just it kicked off. Um, we weren't expecting it, I'll tell you the truth, like, you know, for sure. It's a bit of crack, anyway. Fair play to Liam and Cody there for organising it. Like, um, um, I really appreciate it. I didn't kind of want it at the start. Obviously, it was, you know, I had a bit of pride thing with the money and all. Like, I, wouldn't, I was a bit too proud. I didn't really want it. But I suppose Liam went through the same thing and he, he said, no, we're, we're going to go ahead with it now anyway. We are without your... Um, he said, I don't know what I mean. He, just, he said, we're going ahead with it anyway. So there's nothing I could... So I, I really appreciate it. everyone's just been great, like, you know, and it's, 
it'll make you want to come back twice as strong, you know, play for your county after you see how much everyone has helped me out, like, you know. Everyone was great, like, it was, um, I got powerful support off, like, Liam and Dave Burney there and with the Dublin Supporters Club and um, from your own club as well. And they've been very good to me as well, you know, and everyone has, like, it's, I really appreciate that uh, everyone has done for me, you know, um, because... It's easy for, I suppose, when you're not playing or nothing, like, you can be forgotten about very easily. You can, at the end of the day, like, the hurling goes out, like, you have to go back, you have to go, if you're playing a match Sunday, you have to still have to go for work the Monday morning, like, so, with all hurling gone out, like, people have been great, like, even at work, and everyone has been a really appreciated, so everyone's done for me, you know.